Hey guys, I'm Mike Caviani. I'm the Dog Behavior Program Manager here at Austin Pets Live. And in this video, we're going to cover something that we call the door routine. So, the door routine. We teach it to every dog here at the shelter that leaving their kennel or going out through doors, out to fun stuff, is there's a, there's a routine that they have to do at each doorway, at each door, to go to get access to all the cool things in life. We just want to make sure that when a dog gets to a door, they understand that an open door is not an invitation to bolt through it, right? That can be a pretty useful skill if you think about it. We don't want dogs bolting through open doors and getting loose, getting lost. That can be a, a serious safety issue. And then beyond that, we want dogs to like respect doorways, to understand that a door means, okay, got it, I've gotta, gotta do something in order to get access to walking through this door. So let's get them in a calm, composed state of mind. Let's get them sitting. Let's get them offering eye contact. Let's get them holding that sit while you open that door. And then with that butt on the ground, eye contact with the handler, free, and that's their cue that they can walk through that doorway with you. That can really help set the tone of your walk. That can help set the tone of, of any of your outings because the dog is already kind of connected to you and already working and already in that working mind so that when you head out your front door and there's all those distractions in your neighborhood, the other dogs, the bicyclists, the joggers, the dog's not just bolting through the front door waiting to you know, pull you through the neighborhood. They're already connected to you and working with you and you guys, are, it's a partnership versus you just getting dragged through your walk, all right? So that's why we're gonna cover door routine. Amy Jones is gonna show that to you like always and we'll see how it goes, thanks. All right, so Amy's bringing Brutus into the training room and she's showing up to that door, but she wants to make sure Brutus knows that that open door, nice, is not a cue to bolt through. So you notice Brutus stuck his nose through the gap. Amy just closed that door real quick. You need to do it a couple times, just using that door to go in and out real quickly to just show the dog, no, don't, don't do that. You wanna hesitate and not bolt through that door. So now he caught himself. So now he's holding that sit. So now Amy is just working on moving through that door in these approximations. So she's reminding, moving that door a little bit with her foot, rewarding him for holding it, and then utilizing that leash pressure whenever he pops up. You'll definitely wanna watch our videos on teaching sits with duration and distance and distractions before this video. This is kinda of how to put that all together to teach your dog to hold their sit while you work through a door. So she's using her foot, using her hands, reminding, moving, and then once she's got the butt on the ground, eye contact with her, and she's far enough through the, the gap, she can release him to enter the door. So that's a door routine. So we kind of put everything together, right? We've got sits with duration and distance and distraction all in one to teach the dog to hold their sit, watch the handler while that door opens. They're heading out for a nice exciting walk, but you've still, you still got to be in control, in your right state of mind, and connected to, to, your, to your owner before you get to go out and have fun. So that was a door routine with Brutus. That was awesome.